Hey guys, welcome back to what is finally a new YouTube video. Um, I usually do all of my openings over on my TikTok, uh, because, you know, it's quick and easy. But this one is a little bit of an important one. Um, I don't know if any of you guys watch Nerdy Crafter, but she's opened these, um, mystery mini dollhouse bottles from AliExpress before. So I bought me some, and that's the main part of this video. So, um, I've got a pretty big package here. Uh, it's a combined package with a lot of my stuff in it. This is four out of the, uh, what was it, seven that I ordered? Seven different things that I ordered. So, let me just snip this open. Hope I don't get anything that I've ordered cut or anything. Let's get this started off. Yeah, so there's our, there are separate packages here. One, two... Three, four. One is super heavy. Okay. Big package gone. Let's start very, very small with. Oh, I almost just flat out showed my dress on here. This one. Now, the uh, sticker is pretty big on it because, you know, there was no good place to put the sticker. So, um. Oh, I know what these are. Okay. So, this is something I'm actually really excited about. Oh no, something got broke. That's kind of sad. Um, so first up we have my little lollipops. It came with 50 pieces. This is originally supposed to be for nail art stuff. Let me see if I can open it real quick. Um, shoot. Packages are falling in the floor. Okay. Okay. Here we go. And I did have to buy an all-new accessory compartment for the LPS stuff because of all this new stuff I'm getting. Um, but yeah, we have different little lollipops here. My favorite, personally, is the rainbow ones. They look like they're just beads on top of like little sucker sticks, but you know, I don't mind. Oh, I don't mind that because they're still so cute. I think yeah, there's a broken one here, as you can see. Sad, but you know, things happen. It's okay. I've got. 49 others to make do with me for now. Okay, next we'll do... Okay, we'll do that one. That second to last. No, wait. Um, now I'm not sure which is which. So I'll just cut them open. Keep inside. Yeah, this is just... It's just really protected. Okay. Next up we're opening this one. I've already cut it open and taken out what is inside. We get this big bubble wrap thingy. And if we reach inside and pull out, oh my dog! I forgot this is where I ordered the French fries from. I completely forgot about that. Um, come open. Oh, and the lid comes off. Oh my dog, y'all. Okay, hang on. I gotta show this one first. I know this is kind of like. Sorry if my recording's really flaky right now but oh my dog I'm going to implode because this is so cute okay so of course I got another burger I've got some more burgers and stuff coming this will be another video I might just do it on my tiktok um so if you're not following me on tiktok and you're interested in this types of videos and you do have tiktok or allowed to have tiktok please do go over there little french fries so cute and then the star of the show. I was supposed to get a little bag, but I guess they didn't give me one. Um, star of the show here. Come on. Is that going to focus? There we go. Well, if I could. There. It's a little McDonald's cup. It comes with a little straw and a lid. So you can just. Oh, dog, look at how cute that is. So, there's my McDonald's meal. Next, as you can see, I've ordered, I think it's 10 french fries. Uh, let's open these up. And yeah, nothing much to say about these, they're just things of french fries. I didn't show you one of them from my other 
because I felt like I needed more like junk food, fast food type stuff, so I ordered some. Yeah, that's basically the gist of what all this is. I know I'm just shoving everything into the background and that's not really efficient, but oh well. Next, is this the... yeah, that's what this is. Okay. Cutting just the corner because I know that they're in plastic baggies and I don't want to cut up the baggies. Okay. So these are also supposed to be nail decoration things. Um, oh, they're so cute. I love them. I'm so in love. Okay. So, as you can see, I before I have bought these little things, they're like, um, they're little jars with little, they're supposed to be like for like slime charms or nail art charms in them. And you can take the stuff out and everything. I use them for all kinds of stuff, and I think they're really cute. I got them off of Amazon. Then I found an AliExpress for like 75 cents a piece. You can get these um, these charms just by themselves, and you get a thousand of them supposedly. Looks like a thousand in there. I got little watermelons, little strawberries, grapefruits. Because I didn't have any grapefruits in the last one. Just little sweets and stuff. I mostly see little lollipop swirls. They got all kinds of stuff right there. And lastly, different little fruits. I can see some bananas in there. That was my main reason for buying them. Um, they're just, they're so cute. I just, I, and they make for great, like, little decorations and backgrounds and stuff like that. And so, yeah. Now the last little package. This one's the one that's going to take us longest, so... If you've watched this far in your board, might as well click off now because this is the part that gets long. Um, oh, it's not going to be a complete mystery. They don't have them in mystery bags. Oh, I'm so mad. Oh, and they're bigger than they said they would be. Okay, I can work with this though. Okay. I'm not going to look. I'm not going to look. I'm not going to look. I'm just going to stick them back here. Actually, you know, it would be a better idea if I just dumped them in the package and just picked them out one by one. Don't look, don't look, don't look, because I thought they were supposed to be like a mystery, but apparently they just scooped a bunch of them in a bag and sent them to me. Okay, so these are little bottles, uh, the ones that, uh, like, the ones that Nerdy Crackers opened, but, um, they're supposed to be 112 scale, but they don't really look 112 scale in some cases, but, okay, so our first one is this little bottle can't really read what it says, but it is cute. It's probably some sort of alcohol. Um, next up, it's a little cup of jelly, I think. Really cute. Man, this video is going to be long because this is take. You can see that's not 112 scale. Because usually 112 scale works really well for little pet shops, but this is massive compared to him. Like, that's not what the real size would be. It's okay though, I still really enjoy it. Okay, I'm just gonna pick the package up and dig in there and pick one out. Okay. We get a little Starbucks drink, like the ones that you'd find in a store, like um, the ones they keep in coolers, like up front. Next is. <laughs> it's a little mug, but I don't know what it says or who that is on it. It's kind of funny. Again, massive for a little pet shop, but because usually 112 scale works with these, and to my knowledge, these are not 112 scale, or maybe some of them might be. I'm not sure. Not all of them are. I know that much for sure. Um, next up is this square bottle, square-ish bottle. Really weird bottle right there. Strange. Next. Oh, this one's super weird. Oh, like, why would you make that into a... I don't know if it's supposed to be a drink, or... No, it looks like it's... Okay. Double mint. Looks like it'd be like... You know how the, um... Icebreakers ice cubes come in the cube-shaped containers? Yeah, this looks like, uh... Just double mint version of that, but different. So, yeah. Next up. It's the same bottle as the first one. It's just pink this time. These are really well made compared to some of the ones that I've seen before, like on videos. 
Okay, maybe we need to speed run this. Okay, I grabbed a little handful. Oh, yes! Yes, look at this. Fanta, orange Fanta is my favorite drink of all time. I'm not sure if it's orange Fanta right there. It, it looks like it should be. But they have a little Fanta bottle for my little special ops. Oh my god. That's so cute. Next we've got... Power Ben Food, I think. Cute little bottle. Oh, and I really like this one. This looks to be like some sort of like, um, kind of like V8 or something like that. You know how they have like the vegetables and fruit mixes and stuff like that. Yeah. Um. Sorry, this video is gonna be so long. Like I said, if you're not interested in watching all this, uh, click off. But um. Next. A pink Starbucks drink. This is really cute, actually. So, basically, just like pink drink. I've never had that. I'm not a big fan of like fruitier flavors and stuff. But next, we have this A D something V A V O something like that. I don't know. Really cute. Next, we have a little blue Starbucks mug. I think I've already got a Starbucks mug. It's just white. I think. So yeah, really cute. A lot of Starbucks stuff in this one, but here's another one. It's just a little classic coffee cup. Next. I hope I get some water bottles in here because I really want some water bottles. This one is a similar bottle to the first two, but it's different. It's called Bombay Sapphire. I think that's really cute too. I think everything's cute. Like, all these little bottles and stuff are really cute. Next up, um, this one is completely in a different language and I cannot read it, but really cute bottle. I'm glad most of them are not alcohol, because then it wouldn't have been easy to use them for just about anything, but next is another probably like V8 type juice. Really cute bottle, I like the pink color. Next, uh, this looks to be some sort of, maybe like a melon soda water, oh no, it's, oh, sorry. It looks to be Ramune, actually, from the shape of the bottle, look at the way the bottle's shaped. Definitely melon Ramune, which if you don't know, Ramune is Japanese, um, soda, where you, like, you punch the marble in and stuff. Really cute. Next is another, like, fruit juice type thing. It says 50% up there at the top, or 30, 30%, my bad. Um, next, oh, this looks to be some, like, some more gum too, because of the shape of the bottle, or maybe, like, you could use it, like, as medicine, some sort of lemon thing. It's got all the details on it, that's so cute. Stand up, please. I'm really wanting some just regular water bottles, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna get any. This one is just called Fizz. Yeah, cute. This one, I see blueberries on there, but I'm not sure what everything else is. It says 50%. Got little fruits and stuff on the bottle. Cute little bottle cap, too it'll focus yeah next is did we already get one of these yeah so here is our first double which that's okay because it would work for store displays and it's taken a while to get a double here so not trying to jinx it or anything next is this not even sure what this could be um Lemon water of some sort. Cute. Next, this one is called Great Wall. It seems to be some sort of alcohol ink beverage. Come on, focus for me. Oh, shoot. Yeah, see, there it's called Great Wall. It looks a lot like an alcohol bottle. Next, oh, what is that? I'm gonna reach in and grab that one and just show it. That's not a drink, that's popcorn! Oh my dog, look at that! Look at how cute that is. <laughs> it 
It's like it's specifically for a premiere of some sort of movie, but I'm not sure what. Or maybe those are like mascots of the movie theater or something, but yeah, really cute. Um, let's see, do I have space that doesn't matter on this package? Oh yes, there is a water bottle in here. Not quite the one that I would have wanted, but oh, that one's cute too. Look at this. It is a Starbucks drink. I'm not sure what this on the side is supposed to be. Probably just a mess up. It's got a little heart on the top, and it's this clear blue color. It's really cute. Why is it kind of a toothpaste? Yeah, here is a um a water bottle. It says Evergans. Oh, Evergans Spring. It's like a spring water type thing. Really cute. I think that's the only um water I see water bottle. Oh well. Um. Next up, we have a little another Starbucks pink drink. That's fine because I know a lot of people really like those. That'll be pretty useful. Um, I'll pick up the next weird one that I see here. This is perfume. Chanel Paris perfume. I don't know much about it, but definitely perfume bottle, not a, um, not like a drink or anything, but, you know, it's fine. Next, I've got this toothpaste. It says Darley on it. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Yeah. A really cute toothpaste tube. Don't get me wrong. Um, uh, next I have Blue Jack Daniels. And the label's kind of messed up. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Next I have what looks like it would be considered a 2 liter alien energy. So it's an energy drink. Um, really cute. I mean, I like the rainbows on it. Yeah. Next up is... What is this? It looks like laundry pods. On the packaging there. I could be wrong. If you know anything about it, let me know. Tell me if I'm wrong. Correct me. Stuff like that. But that there looks like a laundry pod. To me, at least. So, it's got a cute little polar bear on it. Next, um, we've got another alcohol bottle. Oh, it's one of those witch ones that, um, I think Nerdy Crafter got. I've been calling her Nerdy or uh, Salty, because Salty Crafter is, like, one of her, like, alter ego things. It's a really cute. I, it, you can't really see what it says on the label. I know that hers, I think it said something in English, if I'm not mistaken, so. Next is Bundaberg. It says passion fruit. Fruit. No, it says passion fruit. Okay. Oh, shoot. If I could quit doing that. It'd be nice. Yeah, it says passion fruit. Very nice. Um... <gasps> yes, I got a Are You Kidding Me bottle. Could be used as a water bottle too. You can just barely see what it says there, but it says Are You Kidding Me in pink. I love that. Okay, next I'm going to show you the one that I've got four of over here. Um, which is kind of weird. Um, you can set these in the background because they're all the same bottle as you can see, but... Oh, hang on, I think I actually have five of those. Yeah, it's the same one from earlier, so. Kind of weird how I got five of those, but I haven't gotten much other doubles. Um, next is a, it looks like it would be a glass bottle of Sunkist. Blue something of some sort. Don't know, I can't read the bottle. Got nutrition packs and all that on there. Might be a country exclusive type thing. Um. I will stop bumping the camera in a minute. I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm trying not to, and now I'm messing everything up. Um, next we got this camel-looking drink. I say camel because it's got a camel on it. It's really cute. Not bad. Next is this called Saint Boniface. Boniface? I don't know. <laughs> kind of cute. 
Um, let me see, is there any others I got on here that are doubles? I think I've showed this one before already, so I'm just going to show you guys real quick and put it over here. Um, this one I've already got back there. Um, this one I've already shown once. This is the Saint Boniface, but in a different color. There's this one, I'm not sure if I've shown one like this yet. Oh, come on, please. There we go. And then last but not least, yet another of the deer. No, it's not a deer. It says, oh, it's another Bombay Sapphire. So, yeah, sorry for the super long video, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Um, I enjoyed opening them. Uh, I was hoping for some more, like, water bottles and stuff, but I'm happy with what I got. Uh, just, I hope you guys enjoyed I'm sorry for the long video. If you're here from TikTok and you're still watching, really appreciate it, because I know that on TikTok, I mean, I barely have an attention span long enough to sit there and, like, if I'm on TikTok, I'm on TikTok, you know. But if I'm on YouTube, I'm on YouTube. So, yeah, if you stuck around for the whole thing, thank you. I highly doubt anybody did, but... Cause, you know, I mostly do these openings for my own enjoyment. I like going back and watching myself open stuff because I really like unboxing videos. But if there's somebody else out there who's enjoyed it as much as I have, thank you so much for watching. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed and bye!